Hello. So we are back, yeah? Monday. Uh, let's start the job. Okay, what's wrong with OBS? Encoding overloaded. Hopefully now the picture is good. Let's start a job, yeah? It's, you know, I have a guy. It's a, it's a nice guy. He always he try to fix things. So when something is not working, he bring the, the jobs to us. Yeah, so let's try to help him. Yeah, let's see what the problem is in this one. He said the phone may smoke. It's an iPhone, obviously. Yeah. Put the charger and see smoke coming from the charging port. But he said he tried with different charging port. What's that? Okay, these are some magnetic things with the screws. Okay, that's good. So he said he tried a different charging port. And uh, he didn't work. So I suppose we have a dead phone, but I will check with different charging port. One second. iPhone 6. Battery. That's the one. No, this is 6S. Now give me a second. Okay. Uh, I need to charge one of the battery. Yeah, I'm going to put the car. Yeah. Okay. okay, I switched the camera instead of stopping the microphone. I can't believe. So let's see. A new charging port, new battery, let's see if it's charging and if it's working. Let's try to help him. So what's wrong with this one? is not iPhone 6 charging port no it has two microphones this is 6s one second Yeah, so the 6 has only one microphone. The 6S has two microphones. It's no smell. A burning smell. Let's see what he's doing first. If Diana can find a charging port for iPhone 6. Oh, she did find one. I see. Let's see now. Yes. Okay, the battery. Or maybe not. I should try the board to see if it's short at first. 3.9 around 1.5 amps. Let's see. Okay, that's not good. It's taking 2 amps. 
Uh, this is a good opportunity to check my freezing spray, my pipe freezing spray. At 1.6 amps, yeah? On the plus, yeah? So that's ground. That's plus. So we, it's not even point checking. Uh, and it's getting harder processor. Really? Let's check one more time. Uh, no, something here. Probably the power manager. Probably. Yeah, let's freeze the board. Yeah? Let's do it, let's do it. The board is, is frozen. Let's put a plus. I uh, know. Actually, something else. I should use more. Okay, now it's white. Let's try again. Plus plus one point six amps. So what is shorted there? Let's show you the battery, see if it's working. Plug the battery. Because it's more handy to use the battery instead of using the power supply. Yeah. yeah it is working. Okay, one more time. Let's go on the microscope, yeah? Or not. Maybe I can't do it. Yeah, maybe. No. It should be able. Okay, this is an easy one. This is an easy job. So it's not the power manager. Is something else? Yeah, one second. Okay, I don't know why the microscope is not starting. Okay, it's on. So let's have a look together. Let's froze the motherboard. Okay, the board is frozen, yeah? Let's plug the battery. But how can I do it? Yeah, like that. Okay. It should be more faster. Yeah, that's the board. Let's plug the battery. Just someone like a nice picture. Now? No, not now. One more time. Now. Okay, so it's something there. But the problem is, you know, with the spray. I, I should lower the amps. Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's lower the amps. Uh, but it's not important because I'm using the battery. Okay, let's lower the amps and use the power supply to see exactly 
to see exactly what is getting hot here. Yeah? So I lower the arms and I will use uh, from this side. Oh, where is it? Where is it? And now it's like 20 milliamps. Well, I can't see anything. Okay. So something there. Something on this area. Okay, you know what? Okay. Let's use uh, what we know, yeah? Let's use the petrol, yeah? That's more better on this case. The, the freezing spray is not helpful. No, in my case. So we'll use petrol. Yeah, we have petrol. We have a lot of petrol there. Let's connect the battery. Let's see what is getting dry first time, yeah? So what is getting dried? Now the battery is connected. It's smoking. Wait, something is smoking here. It's smoking again. So we can see, no you can't see, it's bubbling, that's bad, so everything is bubbling. So all this is possible. So look. So actually the Broadcom chip, wow, that's proper hot. So this one, the Broadcom, the, the touch AC. It's not getting the first, it's getting the first dry. For the power manager, what do you think? It's like all the area. No, I can't. I don't think it's here. No, listen to me. I don't think it's here. Look, it's smoking. You see that smoke? So I think our problem is here. Under the processor case, yeah? Let's, let's take that thing out. The shield, yeah? I think here is the problem. Let me grab a nozzle. Temperature. 
creative and let's open this shield yeah possible to be processor to be shorted yes possible but I don't think so you know why because if the processor is shorted the processor power supply the processor power supply is the power manager so the power manager is creating voltage for the processor so if if will be to processor to be shorted uh, the power management chip it will get no power from the battery but in my case it's a short so I know for sure the processor is not connected straight to the battery so it's not the processor can be the back light, yeah the back light can be the back light yeah can be So let's see together. Uh, I should try myself first. Yeah, exactly what I told you. Yeah? Exactly what I told you. So our problem... Our problem... It is on focus. Good. Let's use more petrol. Now let's connect the battery. Yeah? I will connect the battery. Just check that. You see? So what, what happened? Exactly what happened? What is happening there? Yeah? You should have in mind the schematic. You have the battery, you have uh, the after that, you have the that MOSFET, you have the VCC mainline. From the VCC mainline, many things are, are getting powered. One of the inf these things is the backlight, yeah? But how is going? You have the backlight, it's going on the serial mode to the coil, the backlight coil, this one, yeah? This one from here. And after that, on serial mode, with this diode, short key, short key diode, yeah? This one from here, yeah? And from the output of this diode, is going straight to the screen connector, here somewhere, yeah? Where, where the IC is connected? The IC is connected here before this scotchy diode, short key, sorry. And what the IC is doing is switching the coil to the ground. That's the way how the voltage get created. Yeah. So I don't think this is a shorted coil uh, diode. Sorry. One more time. Yeah. You see? Let me go close. So I don't think this is a shorted diode. I think we have a short o over the diode. Yeah. One more time, I will put the battery. Yeah, look. Uh, I put the battery. I take the battery. I put the battery, I take the battery. Yeah? You can see what the diode is doing. It's like breathing. Breathing. Breath. Yeah. So something is shorted. No. No, is not the IC. 
because the IC is connected, so it's, it's switching to ground before the diode. The plus of the diode is here, yeah? So from the plus of the diode is going there, but also from the plus of the diode we have few capacitor, these ones, which are connected to ground. You see these brown ones? Yeah, all these three brown capacitor are brown from one reason. Uh, high capacity, yeah. High capacity, high voltage. No, high voltage. Because there should be like 25 up to 30, 40 volts, I think, 25. And if I go now with the multimeter, I will take the multimeter, I will switch the multimeter in a diode mode. If I will be to check, yeah. Let's connect this to ground there, and let's check the output of the diode. And the output of the diode... Yeah, zero, okay. Let's try one more time. It is on focus. Now it is. The output of this diode is like 99. So it's not completely shorted, yeah? Okay, what about before diode? You think we have a shorted diode? No, it's not. So before diode... Before diode, they have nothing. Let me try on the other. Yeah, so here is no short. You can see 0 0.3 volts. Yeah. But here is like partial short. Yeah. Partial short does mean my backlight screen line is shorter to ground. Most likely, one of these cap from here is shorted to ground. Not this. These are on the VCC main. These are on the output. Yeah. So if I go now to check, these are all connected together. So if I check this, same thing. Yeah. So one of these cap is dead. But which one? You know how can I check without... You can't check, no. With the battery, no. The diode is getting hot, not the capacitor. So I will come with the voltage after this diode. on Straight on these caps. Straight on these caps. And I will see which one is dead. Yeah? So I will get my power supply. 4 volts is fine. Now let's see. Uh, it's not important when it... Probably this is ground because it's doing anything. What about on this side? 1.7 So what do you think? What do you think? Just look on the... One, one of these three capacitors is gone, yeah? One of these capacitors. So I come with the voltage You look on that cap, it's getting dry instantly. It's smoking also. So that cap is gone, yeah? This capacitor is gone. Now one problem, yeah? One problem, if you will use hot air here, it's very possible to end with a, with a, 
you have to replace the this the, the light backlight IC which is not easy to be replaced even for me it's hard because everything is small there this one yeah So we remove this capacitor. Let's check now for short, yeah, multimeter. And it's not short anymore. We can see on the on the screen it's not short anymore. What I will do now? What I will do? Okay, I'll switch. I'll dry the board quickly. Okay. Let's try it, yeah? Let's plug the screen. Okay, let's plug the charging port. Okay, let's plug the battery. Yeah. Now let's plug the charger, yeah. And the phone it's on. Uh, and the backlight is fine. Okay, I can't take the stickers out. Just wait for the screen to come on yeah yeah we do have an upper logo there but that's funny it's making me thinking actually on the other side of the board that's freezing spray but it's not And the phone is on and it's working fine, yeah? Okay. So you see like on this case. Uh, the freezing spray being too sensible on the heat. The, he, he didn't give me like an idea where is the fault. So actually with the petrol. I was be able to find actually the problem is on the other side. Yeah, it's working fine. It's charging fine. One point four amps. So the phone is fine. I'm happy. I could. Uh, I could help the man. Because you know, also he's trying to fix and he's trying to earn some money. So it's good we can help each other. Yeah. Okay. I think that's all for today. Yeah. But you understand? Yeah. The last video with the uh, people ask me about that software. Yeah, one second. Desktop. So I'm using this software, this software, phone board, which is free to use, but you have only board view. Yeah. On our case, phones, iPhone six. Yeah, just to have a clear image about how this is working. This part of the board A let's zoom it so I know already these things but probably you didn't you don't know them so one more time yeah what we have here here we have the coil yeah the coil is straight on the here this is main VCC you can see uh, on the on the bottom net name PP VCC main yeah 
Okay, so this is VCC main. These two first capacitors are connected to VCC main. This is ground, yeah? All what is green is ground. So like how I told you, you have two capacitors. Even, even these two capacitors, I found them short. Uh, I found this capacitor shorted. So these are, one second, 10 micro, 6.3 volts. What about this? Uh... 2.2 mic 6 okay no this is wrong okay this is wrong this schematics is wrong from the simple reason these all three are together yeah you can see so this is a mistake so who who made the board view made a mistake so actually these two capacitor 25 volts which is right yeah so that capacitor can be 25 volts this one 25 volts but look at this one this one is saying on the schematics 6.3 volts which is not true they're all are in parallel mode yeah all the three capacitors are in parallel mode and obviously the voltage it's around 25 volts so this is impossible to be there as 6.3 volts capacitor okay so this is a mistake this capacitor had they had another they have another color like more brownish because are high voltage ones like this 20 25 volts yeah so one more time yeah this yeah this is vcc main yeah you can see here pp vcc main after that we have the coil yeah coil from the coil is coming to the diode and one to the chip because the chip is switching to ground this voltage and from the output of the diode output of the diode probably is going to the chip so he can control the output he can see the output the chip can see the output and he can switch fast or slower yeah and he has the three capacitors on the parallel mode to the ground, yeah. And from here he's going straight here. It's you have a fuse here, yeah. Fuse, and from the fuse is going to the screen. It's simple. It's, it's quite a simple one, you know. Actually, a, a laptop power supply is more complicated compared with this one. This is a simple switching power supply. Okay. So hopefully I made clear this how the the things works yeah we're going out to have a nice lunch break and yeah, the phone is still working sorry yeah see you on the next one the man gave me more phones so probably I'll do another video okay bye